Imagine a place where majestic palaces, ancient castles, and mystical gardens exist, all nestled within a lush green mountain range. Welcome to Sintra, Portugal. A gem of a town that's steeped in rich history, Sintra's charm is undeniable. Once the summer residence of Portuguese kings, this haven of architectural beauty has since been graced with UNESCO World Heritage status. Its allure is far-reaching, captivating travelers from all corners of the globe. Here you can bask in the shadow of romantic palaces, get lost in the labyrinthine streets of the old town, or find solitude in its mystical forests. Every corner of Sintra is a testament to human creativity and nature's beauty, coexisting in perfect harmony. It's a town that's not just seen but experienced, its magic seeping into your very bones. Ready to explore the top 15 must-visit attractions in Sintra? Buckle up, because we're about to embark on an epic adventure. Kicking off our countdown at number 15 is the Olga Kataval Cultural Center. In the heart of Sintra, this remarkable building stands out as a beacon of culture. Its unique architecture is a testament to the city's vibrant artistic spirit. The center hosts an array of cultural events, from music and dance performances to art exhibitions, bringing together artists and enthusiasts from around the globe. It's a hub of creativity and a testament to the city's commitment to the arts. A perfect blend of culture and entertainment, the Olga Kataval Cultural Center truly is a gem. At number 14 we have the Modern Art Museum. This museum is a treasure trove of creativity, showcasing a stunning collection from both national and international artists. It's a fusion of diverse styles, perspectives and narratives, offering a vibrant palette of modern and contemporary art. Each exhibition tells a unique story, inviting you to delve into the artist world and view their reality through their eyes. It's a place where art becomes a language, speaking directly to your soul. For art enthusiasts, a visit to this museum is an absolute must. Climbing to number 13, we board the iconic Sintra tram. Trundling through the historic city of Sintra since the early 20th century, this charming tram car offers a journey of unparalleled beauty. As it weaves its way from the heart of Sintra to the sandy shores of Praia das Macas, you'll be treated to a scenic symphony of lush greenery, quaint villages, and breathtaking coastal views. A ride on the Sintra tram gives you a taste of the old world charm that this city exudes. At number 12, we find ourselves at the edge of Europe, Cabo de Roca. As Europe's westernmost point, it's a place of awe-inspiring beauty, where the Atlantic Ocean unfolds in all its majestic grandeur. Standing here, one can't help but be moved by the sheer power of the elements. The swirling winds, the crashing waves and the endless horizon all combine to create an unforgettable spectacle. Cabo de Roca, where the land ends and the sea begins, offers a view you'll never forget. At number 11, we dive into the mystical world of the Sintra Myths and Legends Interactive Center. This magical hub immerses visitors in the captivating stories that have shaped Sintra's cultural fabric. Through immersive exhibits we explore ancient legends, unravel mythical narratives and encounter fabled characters. The center's engaging approach brings to life tales of giants, witches and royal intrigue that echo through the ages. This journey through lore and imagination underscores the allure of Sintra. This center truly captures the essence of Sintra's enchanting tales. Crashing into number 10 we find ourselves at the stunning Adraga Beach. A natural paradise, Adraga Beach is adorned with dramatic rock formations that rise from the sea like ancient sculptures. The sun's rays glisten on the crystal clear waters, creating a mesmerizing display of nature's beauty. But what's a beach trip without some seafood? Here, local eateries serve up the day's freshest catch, a delightful treat for your taste buds. Adraga Beach is the perfect escape for those seeking tranquility and beauty. At number 9, we venture into the captivating Quinta da Regalera. This enchanting estate unfurls a world of mystical architecture, with towers reaching for the sky and gothic facades that whisper tales of the past. The gardens are a labyrinth of green, hiding secret tunnels and grottos ready for the adventurous to explore. From the winding paths to the mysterious wells, every corner of Quinta da Regalera is steeped in intrigue and beauty. Quinta da Regalera, a place where fantasy comes to life. At number 8, we explore the historic Sintra National Palace. With roots dating back to the Middle Ages, this architectural marvel is a testament to Portugal's richly woven tapestry of history. The palace's unique blend of Gothic, Manueline, Moorish and Mudajar styles is a visual feast. And then there are the iconic twin chimneys, a remarkable feature that punctuates Sintra's skyline. 
these towering structures are attached to a grand kitchen, hinting at the lavish feasts of yore. The Sintra National Palace is a journey back in time. At number 7 we discover the mesmerizing Monserrate Palace. This palace is a visual feast, an exquisite blend of Gothic, Indian and Moorish styles of architecture that leaves visitors spellbound. Each design element whispers tales of a bygone era, all set amidst stunning gardens that serve as a lush backdrop to this architectural marvel. The gardens with their exotic species of plants are a testament to the palace's historic love affair with botany. Montserrat Palace, a true architectural masterpiece. At number 6 we visit the picturesque village of Azenhas Domar. This charming place is a marvel of nature and architecture, with white houses perched precariously on the cliffside, as if clinging for dear life. The view of the Azure Ocean is truly breathtaking, a sight that will leave you awestruck. Adding to its charm is a natural swimming pool carved out by the sea itself. Azenhas Domar, a hidden gem waiting to be discovered. Cracking the top 5, we have the majestic Pina Palace. This vibrant marvel with its riot of colors is a sight to behold. It is a testament to Portugal's 19th century romanticism, reflecting an era of exploration and discovery. As you explore its rich history you'll feel as if you've stepped into a fairy tale. And let's not forget the panoramic views from its terraces, they offer a breathtaking vista of Sintra, framed by lush greenery and clear skies. Pena Palace, a symbol of Portugal's romanticism. At number 4, we ascend the lush Sintra Mountain. A paradise for nature lovers, this mountain teems with a rich biodiversity that enchants every visitor. Follow the winding hiking trails through the dense green canopies, and discover a world that seems untouched by time. As you reach the summit, prepare to have your breath taken away by sweeping views of Sintra and beyond. Whether you're a seasoned hiker or a casual stroller, the mountain offers experiences for all. Sintra Mountain, where nature and adventure intertwine. At number 3, we storm the Castle of the Moors. This impressive stronghold dates back to the 8th century during Moorish rule. With its formidable fortifications, it's a testament to the architectural prowess of ancient civilizations. But it's not just about the castle's historical significance. From its high vantage point, you are treated to breathtaking panoramic views of Sintra, a sight that truly makes a visit here unforgettable. So, prepare to be captivated by the Castle of the Moors, a mighty fortress with a view. At number 2, we soak up the sun at Praia Grande. This is not just any beach, it's a surfer's paradise with a vast, sandy stretch that seems to go on forever. But it's not just the surf that's a draw. Here lies a remarkable piece of history etched on the cliffs, dinosaur footprints, a testament to a time long past. It's fascinating how Praia Grande merges the thrill of the present with a connection to the ancient past. Praia Grande, where history and leisure meet. And finally at number one we wander through the enchanting Pena Park. This expansive oasis nestled in the heart of Sintra, boasts a diverse collection of trees from all corners of the globe, creating a lush and colorful landscape. As you meander through the park's winding trails, you'll be rewarded with breathtaking views that encapsulate the beauty and charm of Sintra. From serene ponds to stunning vistas, every corner of Pina Park is a testament to the tranquility of nature. Pina Park, a haven of peace and beauty. Sintra, Portugal, a city that's like stepping into a fairy tale. The Olga Cataval Cultural Center, a haven for art lovers. The Modern Art Museum, a testament to the creative spirit. The nostalgic Sintra Tram, a journey back in time. Cabo de Roca, the edge of the world. Sintra Myths and Legends Interactive Center, where history comes alive. The breathtaking Adraga Beach, Quinta de Regalera, with its mystical allure. Sintra National Palace, a royal retreat the enchanting Monserrate Palace, Azenhas do Mar, a picture-perfect village, and the glorious Pina Palace, Sintra Mountain, a natural wonder, the ancient castle of the Moors, Praia Grande with its golden sands, and the number one attraction, Pina Park, a green paradise. Each attraction is a story, a memory waiting to be made, a new adventure to embark on. These are the top 15 attractions in Sintra, a city that invites you to step into a world of wonder and exploration,